Welcome to All Things Fish. Here we are, about to launch on good old Braidwood Lake here in Braidwood, Illinois. Jack, turn the boat up. I'm out here today with the one and only Chris from KI Outdoors and our boy Billy Matthews from Bass and Bill 96. Hello, sir. So here we are a few weeks after Braidwood opened. It's been hammered now by quite a bit of boats for the past few weeks, so, so the bass are not biting quite as good as they were a few weeks ago, but we still should be able to get on some fish today. We'll see you guys out there. Or some, something was going on, but this guy was not having it. He wasn't using common sense, and he couldn't, you know, conceptualize the fact that there was literally not even one foot waves out, and he refused to let anybody go out on LaSalle Lake for opening day. So we got to waste an hour drive out to LaSalle, and uh, that just sucked. Opening day, I was super hyped up. I got one. Fishing. I got one. Zach's hooked up. All right, we just got the bridge. Nice, baby. Zach's got one. And the DT6. That's pretty much all my rant. I, I just don't understand. Why the heck? There you go. He would not let us out there. Sure. Yeah. I've been out on LaSalle in much, much worse conditions, and it's sucks. But we're on Braidwood Lake now, baby. We're going to try to fish a little tournament. We're versing our good buddy Luke Gasper, giving our best five fish in the boat. But stick around, stay tuned. Hopefully, we catch this. As you guys can see, just stuck my first fish out here while Billy was filming a little bit for his video. Not too bad, pretty short. So we'll go ahead and release this guy. My second fish of the day here, not exactly what we're looking for. <laughs> Real little fish there for my second one of the day. Billy's got a couple in the boat. He's got one keeper in the box here. Unfortunately, I left all my batteries back at the boat ramp. So we got no more GoPro on me. We're running out of camera battery on this one, so we're gonna save the rest of the battery. Hopefully we get some bigger fish. All right guys, my third fish here. Little one pounder, maybe a 12 incher. Not quite 15, that's what it takes to put him on the scale out here. So we're gonna go ahead and toss this guy back. Hopefully we can get on some better fish. Talk to me, baby, talk to the camera. I've had to watch you two catch fish all day long. I've been grinding out here, I've been freaking slinging baits. <laughs> I'm gonna break a couple rods real quick, but that's the juice right there. That's a confidence bait. That'll always get you bit, right? What do you think? I'm a mess right now. I'm gonna keep fishing. There we go, guys. My first keeper of the day. That's a decent one right there for the box. Oh. All right, guys, we're wrapping up the day here. Me and Chris just doubled up. His is a little bit bigger than mine. Both throwing the little Ned rig. I got a little baby bass. Chris got a little one pounder. No big fish today, guys. Day didn't pan out the way we wanted to. Yeet! Oh. Hopefully next time we'll be able to catch some more big bass for you guys, but hey, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Talk to me, Chris. Are you guys ready for what I just caught? <laughs> ew, 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 ew. Get a close up on that. Get a close up on this. Get a close up on this. <laughs> Dude, <I'm> hey, hey. <laughs> yeah, in a second, Chris just caught like a six pounder, but it's a carp. <laughs> 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 